Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you how you can password protect your PDF files for free even if you don't have an Adobe account. Guys, let's get right into it. The first thing we want to do is actually head on over to adobe.com. Now, although we don't need an account to do this and there are no charges, there's no credit cards, nothing like that, you can of course sign up for a free account. Um, but I'm going to show you the easiest and streamlined way to do this completely for free. And to do that, we are going to use adobe.com. Now, Adobe are kind of well known known for obviously creating the PDF and for a whole host of different pieces of software. So it's well worth checking out what they have to offer. Now up here at adobe.com at the very top, you'll find a section for PDF and e-signatures. You're gonna give that a click. With giving that a click, you're gonna come over to where it says quick actions and we're gonna scroll down all the way to where it says view all tools, give that a click. From there, we're gonna scroll all the way down, right? We're gonna forget about everything until we find the sign and protect area just down here. From here, you'll see it says a protect PDF, and this allows you to set a password for a PDF. So we're gonna go ahead and try it for free. We're gonna give that a click. From here, it's going to basically ask you to upload a file. We're gonna click select file. We're just gonna use this one right here, which is an invoice I've got. And then we're basically, it's gonna upload the PDF to adobe.com, and then you get to set the password. Now, depending if you've got like um, yeah, password generators and things like that, you can use those. I'm just gonna quickly type in the word password because I'm original like that. Okay, and of course we have to confirm that password. I like so. Then we're just gonna go ahead and click set password. That's then going to go ahead and protect your PDF by locking it down to the password that you use. Then from here, it's quite straightforward. You can go ahead and create a free account if you don't already have one. I already do have an Adobe account, so I'm just gonna continue with Adobe, logging in. And once that is done, I'm going to basically be able to download. So just bear with me one second. Okay, and once you are logged in and you've got everything kind of set up, you'll be presented with this screen here to enter your password. We'll go ahead and we'll just go ahead and do that. And then that will basically open up your PDF. Once you're into your PDF here, you can of course uh, skip the tour. You don't need that necessarily. Go skip rid of all those things. You can actually go ahead and use this download button just here at the very top to download your encrypted PDF. We we'll click download and it's going to add it straight to your download files. Guys, honestly, it is as easy as that to basically lock down and add a password to your PDF. So if you found this useful, smash the like button, subscribe if you are new for more hints and tips when it comes to everything software related and streamlining your processes. Guys, I'll catch you in the next one.